Welcome to Everyone's a Millionaire podcast. What is your biggest financial mistake or setback and how did you recover from it? And I love this question because we could all learn so much from mistakes, right? That's yeah. typically what mentors teach you is how to avoid these things. So yeah. what was that biggest financial mistake and setback? Well, in uh, 2006-ish, 2006, 2007, I, um, I, I, overextended myself. So I got way too cocky in the real estate game. I had made millions of dollars and I thought I was untouchable, invincible. And so I went out and I got a lot of leverage. So I took on a lot of lending, a lot of loans. I had a ton of loans. I was doing, I was doing, uh, um, uh, buying sub twos. I was doing condo conversions. And when the real estate market turned in 2008, I couldn't debt service anything. And it wiped me fully out. It took all the millions of dollars I had made and it put me in the whole 1.8 million bucks. How'd you recover from it? Um, therapy, <laughs> but, okay. uh, okay. but, but no, really, um, if it, in reality, what happened is I, I took a break, right? I took a break from real estate for a little while. My sister is the one who recovered us. I mean, I, I'm, I'm, I can take, I can take credit for after she put money back in my hands and said, okay, brother, do it again and don't F it up this time. Um, but she pulled us out of, she pulled us out from the hole. Like we had gone to negative. Uh, my sister was working with these like decrepit old buildings in Canada. She turned them around, turned them into government housing, sold them for a million bucks. And we went away. We went back and started our game in Phoenix over again. So I credit it to family, unity, love, uh, being with one another, making sure that you got each other's back, having good sibling relationships, and just making sure that at the end of the day, you take care of everybody in your in in your in your world. Agreed, one hundred percent, man.